Well, if you have lived in Arizona long enough, then you know about micro bursts. Those are those powerful bursts of wind that can cause major damage like what you just saw in Gabriella's shot. Oh, wow. And you can just see the power of this wind. So what causes these? What's happening here? Meteorologist Chris Dunn coming in here to break this whole thing down. What are yep. they, Chris? Uh, well, you know, we see a lot of the damage. And I think, Tram, you said it looks like tornado damage. Yeah. A lot of times micro bursts can result in damage like an EF0, EF1 tornado with similar winds, 100 to 110. 120 mile per hour winds. It all starts with a thunderstorm, and we had plenty of those around yesterday. Uh, we have dry microburst and we have wet microburst. This is an example of a wet microburst with a lot of rain coming in. But typically during the monsoon, we have dry microburst because the air is so dry and evaporational cooling aids in that strong downdraft. So again, it all starts with a thunderstorm. We have updrafts coming into the storm, and we have downdrafts coming out of the storm. And in the middle of this thunderstorm, sometimes that downdraft downdraft can be really concentrated and really strong and very localized. That's why we call it a microburst. It's a relatively small area and as that air hits the ground, it's forced outward and it comes down with great force up to 150 miles per hour in some cases. Uh, in Tempe, we had a report of a 71 mile per hour wind gust and this all happens within about two and a half miles. So again, it's a relatively small area and it can flatten trees, damage buildings. Also a major hazard for airplanes because if an airplane tries to fly through that, it's not going to fly. And there have been a number of major aviation accidents attributed to microburst winds. So that's what we have going on yesterday and what we typically see during the monsoon with strong thunderstorms, strong updrafts and strong downdrafts. And that's what caused this microburst in Tempe yesterday.